The Peoria Fire Department chooses only the best and brightest to join its firefighting family because it's not just putting out fires or saving lives. Being a firefighter is about making the community a better, safer place. Commander Ladder 191, go ahead and go to the roof, give me a roof report. Do not cut a hole till I tell you. Recently, they trained five courageous, hardworking, and committed recruits at the Glendale Regional Public Safety Training Center. We have five guys, five great guys that work together well and, you know, just go out and get the job done and have fun every day. Go in, find the seat of the fire, get it all clear. You're going to find it in the garage. You're going to check overhead, make sure the fire hasn't breached that door or the garage. And you're going to have to hold there. All right. A small group with great expectations and even better attitudes. There's only five of them. They are getting many repetitions. They are getting a lot of hands-on experience. Their classroom experience is much more intimate. And literally halfway through, we could probably put them out in the field and they'd be ready to go. But we are going to keep them in for the full term of the academy. And when they come out, they will be really ready to go. I've always tried to be the best at whatever I'm doing. And here it's not even it doesn't even matter because there's certain things I'm good at and certain things there's the other guys are way better at than I am. It's like there's no way any one of us could be on top all the time because they all we all bring something different to the table. We have a chance to meet people who are already in the field, um, so it's it's given us a chance to meet um, some the people that we're going to be working with here in a few months. Um, so it gives us a leg up in that sense. Um, we get a ton of repetitions because there's only five of us. It's a Peoria Academy with a Peoria RTO and we have Peoria trucks coming down every day to help, to help us get things right. The guys that are coming out here are telling us how they want it done and that's good for us because when we get out there what we've learned is going to coincide with what they expect. That makes it easier for us. I want them to have the worst day in their career to not hold a shadow to a day they had down here. I want their training to be more difficult, more challenging than anything they should have to face in their career. I don't know if that's gonna be the case or not, but that's our goal. We're pushing them as hard as we possibly can, putting them in unmanageable situations, and hopefully they'll go through their career and look back and go, I never had a day like I had in the academy. Come on, ball, we're good! We got off there. 20 seconds. It took them 20 seconds to clear the house. All right, so you're sitting on it, Fire's held here. Kind of sucks for you, but this is your spot. You're gonna stay right here. We're gonna make sure this fire doesn't get past it. And that's why every day we come in, we push ourselves and we have to remind ourselves that we're getting paid to be here because it's so fun and we're having so much fun. It's like, oh yeah, I'm gonna get a paycheck for this. It's fair to say that this is what I'm gonna do the rest of my life. There's not a doubt in my mind. Throughout the grueling mental and physical training, these recruits learn that firefighting takes passion and teamwork and that hard work is rewarding. R.C. Mattock. Bo Taylor. Darren Fox. Uh, my name is Donald Porter. My name is Jeremy Gibbons, and I'm a firefighter recruit with Peoria.